Warning, the following content may contain elements that are not suitable for some audiences. Your discretion is advised. Hello everybody and welcome back to GeoGuessr. We're doing Diverse World 3.0 beta test, map by mapper. Hopefully the beta isn't for much longer because I am super excited about this map. And honestly, I can't wait to see what kind of records you guys put on it. St. Thomas's Chapel. So it's in English. We're on the left-hand side of the road. We have the back of a white car. And we didn't see the black and white signs. Honestly, a lot more English than I thought we were going to see. A lot more English. Now, obviously, we're going to be in Southeast Asia. It, probably between Malaysia and Indonesia. And we're going backwards. And we're leaning more Malaysia here based on the English that we saw. However, that's probably not the best way to do it. And we should probably learn what the black and white sign means. Because I'm pretty sure, if I'm not mistaken, that's Malaysia. But um, I'm not fully there. Now, I do have some good news. And you guys are going to love the good news. Uh, we only have about five minutes left of footage for the GeoGuessr Pro video. Which means it should be finished either by the time this video goes live. Or even potentially a little bit later in the day. Uh, it should be up tomorrow, and I hope you guys are excited for it. I'm super excited for it. I was laughing while watching it, while editing it. So, lots of fun in there. Um, hopefully we can find something else while we're here. I'm looking mainly for like a province, because I don't think we're going to get the town name correct. But if we could see something that like tells us, hey, you aren't Borneo, which I think that's probably the safest place to guess, is the Malaysian side over here. Maybe over by Bintulu, maybe a little bit closer. But I, I think we're, we really need to find the province. If we can find the province, maybe we can get some decent points. We can't even see everything. Uh, I don't think it could be Sri Lanka because of the car. Right, the Sri Lanka car, you can see the front of it, and you can see the patches of the red and the blue of the, the typical Google car. I don't think it's South America, although we didn't even look where the sun was. Uh, sun kind of overhead. Because the only place it could be, it can't even be South America. We're on the left hand side of the road. What the fuck am I talking about? It's, there's no way this is Southern Africa. It's not the UK. It's not Ireland. It's not New Zealand or Australia. It has to be Indonesia, Thailand, Sri Lanka, Malaysia. It has to be. I'm losing my fucking mind over it. We didn't see shit. There's nothing fucking here. Let's go closer to Bintulu and just fucking guess. Uh, and actually, if we would have just kept our guess where it was, there's a good chance we would have uh, beaten Taurus for that one guess. However, he does get an extra 230 points on us. It, it really is the middle of fucking nowhere here. I'm not, uh, I'm not really surprised we didn't see anything. That took us three minutes, and we were still a minute and a half, two minutes out of a major road and Lundu so very rural very remote we got the general area right but that's about it uh gen 2 coverage sun to the north so we are in the south uh if, ooh, we kind of want to see the road markings looks like we have yellow dividers with right on the side which immediately gets rid of all of southern africa uh here we do have the bollards so we do have that but not much else uh, the problem is, I can tell you the region of this, right? I can tell you it's it's New Zealand, Australia. Pretty sure these are Australian bollards, but I might be wrong about that. We do have mountains in the distance. I know they're very similar, and I don't even think they're really considered bollards. They're wooden sticks in the ground with reflectors on them. If that's what constitutes a bollard, by all means... But when you go and see European countries and their version of the baller, it kind of makes more sense. Uh, the Gen 2 coverage, I think, makes more sense for Australia. Uh, I know New Zealand does have it. New Zealand is currently not on GeoTip, so we, we are going to be adding that shortly. We're actually coming up to the last line of, uh, of countries to be added. And this, I, I need to point out, a lot of people think when we add the country, which would ma it makes sense logically what people are thinking. That, that's it, that's all we're adding for the country. We add a preliminary round of information. 
and then we'll go back by people who know the country and add other things. So when we when we first add a country, it's usually the basic stuff. We'll add the Google car, we'll add the bollard, we'll add the camera gens, we'll add the stuff that's super easy to figure out and point out. Then we'll go back over it and add the stuff that uh that kills people. McLaughlin's Beach. And we're not gonna get anything to load? Is this a fucking joke? McLaughlin's Beach 96 and Woodside Beach. I think this has to be New Zealand at this point. Although that's not a New Zealand sign. I don't know where 96 is. I don't know where C's are. Here are the M's. Here are the A's. Where are the B's? Here's 95, which we're looking for 96 in the same general area. So it should be this side. It should be this area. 95, here's one. Here's 96. Uh, different symbol, so not very helpful. The fact that we're looking for beaches doesn't really help us. Can we still find C's? The C roads. Because if this was flipped, that's more of the symbol we're looking for. If we did find 96 up there. I wonder how fucked we are. We're pretty fucked. Mission Beach, fuck it. Ends up being way further south. Way further south. Uh, Taurus gets the better points going with uh, Tasmania instead of the Longitude Gasser of Queensland. Fuck. Kenya, uh, at this point, it doesn't really matter where we guess in Kenya. We're probably not going to find anything. It's it's safe to save three minutes and just throw it in the middle. Exactly. Exactly. So, safe guess. Move on. Looks like left-hand side of the road again. Feels like Southern Africa, especially with the road markings. However, we don't have your typical red-ish, well, the yellowish middle line. We do have bollards. I don't see any rifts, so there goes Senegal. The fact that there's bollards, though, on the left-hand side of the road? The fuck kind of madness is this? We're going to look for language. Uh, we do have the reddish. Eh, it could be Botswana, I suppose. Maybe? The reddish roads? I, I feel like that would be Botswana. But I also feel like you need the yellow divider line. That had language. That had language. This says... Ringwood Road, unsealed section, and a weight limit. Whatever the fuck the weight limit is for. Tortilla Flats and Ringwood Road. Wow. Ringwood Road. Sometimes I can't speak. This is probably going to say the same shit. I don't know where the Tortilla Flats are, but it sounds interesting. I wonder if they make tortillas there. We could just randomly throw down a guess at this point. Uh, white license plates, not too helpful. It's not Gen 2 coverage. Does that take away from South Africa? Uh, could it be a weird Uganda, perhaps? No, because it's not the Uganda car. So it can't be Uganda. It can't be Kenya. It's not going to be Nigeria. It's not going to be Ghana. It's not going to be Senegal. I feel like... Is the sun to the south? But it's nor it's left hand side. There's no way this is England, Ireland, Scotland, Wales, Island of Man. No way it's New Zealand. No way it's Australia. Yeah, it could be Australia. I feel like it has to be Australia at this point. Especially with the white divider lines. Maybe this is Queensland. We do have bollards, but fuck bollards. If I knew bollards, this game would be a million times easier. We're learning them, slowly but surely we're learning them. But they're not all quite there yet. So, fuck that. Uh, same with telephone poles. Telephone poles are pretty helpful. We don't quite have those yet, either. I think we're probably skipping by a lot of important information. Trucks turning. Keep left, unless overtaking. We're missing the yellow divider line, which immediately gets rid of all of Southern Africa. Why didn't we find a single fucking sign? I think it has to be Australia here. There's no other option. It's just, where in Australia? I'm going to go Queensland. Ends up being the Northern Territories. Taurus gets a perfect score. We clearly went the wrong way. 
We were on 1 there. If we would have gone the other way, it looks like we would have found the intersection of 30 and 1. Uh, which, sadly, we did not. We didn't find a single sign that entire time. That entire fucking time. How amazing is that? Uh, we lost. It doesn't matter what we do. Uh, probably the United States. It could be a weird Canada. Uh, we do have... Could be green license plates? But I might be just seeing things. That looks like it could be a kilometer sign. No, but it has some information on it. It's just a great thing. We can't fucking read it. Red fire hydrants. Maybe. Maybe that could be a play. I know fire hydrants change based on color. We do have your typical uh, U.S., well, North American uh, phone number set up. Kind of feels like the middle-ish of Pennsylvania. But the license plates don't really fit for that. There's the flag of the USA. We have the Pine Tree Apartments. Three more USA flags. So now we know for sure we're in the United States. And we don't really get anything off the license plates. However, that's a Patriot sign. Here's here's the problem. Here's the fucking problem. If it is the Patriots, do we automatically go with the Northeast, because that's where the Patriots play, or do we assume it's somebody who's a Patriots fanboy living somewhere else in the country? It's, it's tough when it comes to that, because I'm a Ravens fan, even though I don't live in Maryland. So it's not like sports teams are incredibly helpful unless you're at the stadium. If we did see green on the license plate, and not a full green license plate, that should be Vermont. Because I think Vermont has green text. I think they do. I know New Hampshire is the green plate fully. I feel like this is New Hampshire. I feel like it has to be. Which would make sense for the Patriots. It would make sense for the mountain that we see in the distance. It would make sense with the front license plates. And it would make sense why I thought it was Pennsylvania. The only issue is... They have one single area code. And we haven't seen it. Are we going to see it? We might We might be able to see it. Pretty sure New Hampshire and Vermont have single digits. I'm pretty sure it's like 804 or something. Somewhere around that number. Uh, there's New Hampshire. It says Lancaster. We could try to find Lancaster real quick. Uh, I don't actually know where Lancaster... New Hampshire would be. Uh, I don't see... I mean, obviously we know where it's Bridge Street. Dover, Springfield, Rockholm, Montpelier, Montgomery, Williams, New Haven, Middlebury, Salisbury, Rutland, Castleton, Dorset. Let's just go over by Weston. Fuck it. We're just going to guess right here. Makes sense to me. Uh, and it ends up being really close to the border. Literally... Did we cross... No. Hold the fuck on. We guessed Vermont even though it said New Hampshire. How fucking stupid am I? We were literally on the border when we found that. And there's Lancaster. Why did I... Why did I look in Vermont when I clearly knew it was New Hampshire? What the fuck is going on? Uh, regardless, we lost. Australia can go suck a dick. Uh, Taurus in first place, 23,000. Bow in second at 18.580, Calamity in third at 18.136, uh, and then we came in fourth, uh, fucking up Australia pretty bad. Both times. Both times. Uh, if we would have got better in Australia, I think we would have done fine, but it's Australia. It's it's kind of like Russia. Nobody really cares about it. The Flat Earthers don't even think it's real, so fuck it. Uh, but that's going to be where we call it for the day, so thank you all so much for being here. Sorry that we couldn't stream earlier. The internet was a little shitty. Hopefully this upload works, but we all know how the internet works sometimes. Uh, but that's going to be where we call it, so thank you all so much. I look forward to seeing you guys all tomorrow for stream at 1 p.m. Eastern. Uh, but until then, enjoy the rest of your day, and bye-bye.